I sit him down on the armchair again and crouch in front of him. What's going on? He doesn't look at me or even seem to have heard me. Char. I say this a little louder and this time he meets my eyes. Why are you acting like this? What? He snaps, shaking his head. What am I acting like? Like one minute you're seriously pissed off with me and the next you want to get off with me. He bends over and puts his head in his hands. Oh, I feel sick. For fuck's sake! I stand up. This is hopeless. Why are you being such a dick? He doesn't move. Just talk to me, I say. He says nothing. You can't be angry at me if you can't even tell me what I'm doing wrong. He makes a groaning noise and shakes his head in his hands. Fucking hell, I say, sitting down heavily on the sofa opposite. Well, I don't fucking know what to do then. Stop shouting at me, he mumbles from behind his hands. I am not shouting at you. You are. We sit in silence for a minute until a particularly loud thunder crash makes me jump. Charlie notices and raises his head. You can break up with me if you want. He says, It takes a few seconds to process that. What?